In today's video, we're here to introduce the features of the DEG NOG M20 to C audio interface. First, as we connect the M2 to C to power, you'll notice a highly professional display screen for monitoring input volume, output volume, and headphone volume. This design is something you won't find in other audio interfaces at this price point. It's both exquisitely crafted and looks truly stunning. Next, you'll see buttons for 48 volts 1 and 48 volts 2. These buttons control the switches for input 1 and input 2, essentially acting as mute buttons. If you want to deactivate the channel, simply turn off the respective button. Moving on, the metallic knobs catch your eye. There's no denying the meticulous craftsmanship that went into the M20 to see. The metal knobs have an exceptional tactile feel and enhance its overall appearance. You'll notice the gain 1 knob controls the volume for channel 1, gain 2 for channel 2, line out for output volume, and monitor for headphone volume. Additionally, there's a mono button for switching between mono and stereo. Furthermore, M20 to C offers an air mode, providing users with an additional recording mode for sound effects. This feature is quite rare in the world of audio interfaces, making M20 to C stand out for its versatility and capabilities at this price point. Turning to the back, you'll find the 6.55mm line outputs and a USB Type-C jack. There are no unnecessary bells and whistles here, just a straightforward design that's user-friendly and plug-and-play. Now, let's take a look at M20 to C's technical specifications. It boasts a maximum LR output of 5 volts, supports 16, ohm or 32, ohm headphones with a maximum power of 220 meters. The microphone signal to noise ratio goes up to an impressive 115 decibels, with adjustable gain of up to plus 40 decibels. The signal to noise and distortion ratio as M plus D is 106 decibels. These specs are outstanding within this price range. Additionally, it features Japanese as a Hikase AD, DAW conversion IC, American Audi Digital DSP chip, and Taiwanese Control USB interface chip. If you want to significantly upgrade your music production experience, just click the link to know more about M20 to C. That wraps up our feature presentation on M20 to C. Thank you for tuning in, and in the next episode, We'll be comparing M2 to C with other audio interfaces. Stay tuned.